see Blake have been traded uh, it's maybe 90 minutes before the game. What was that like for you? Uh, personally, it, it kind of was a letdown. You know, first off, um, Steve is a great teammate, uh, but more importantly, off the court. You know, Steve, Steve is a great guy. You know, he, uh, he really embraced me when I got here, helped me out. Um, he works hard. Uh, I feel like the team, you know, really respected him. So, and I think the main thing you you start to feel bad about is you think about his family. You know, he's got three kids in school here, so that's the stuff that kind of goes through my mind. And I guess that's part of the business. But uh, that's that's kind of the downside of uh, playing in this league. You kind of had a, a weird start to your season in that you were in the D League and then you came up. So you've kind of already been seen this movie and been through it. But is this a weird night? to be an NBA player, knowing that anybody on any team could move before noon tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, you know, we, uh, we obviously have a lot of perks playing in this league, but this is one of the downsides, you know. We, at the end of the day, we're still uh, pawns in a big chess game. So at any given moment, you can be up and move. And uh, it's, it's something scary to think about. But um, all, you can, all you can control is what you go out there and do every night and hope for the best. You were able to find a way to impact the game. You, you had some good statistical numbers, but this game was never really competitive. What happened? Um, I mean, we could make excuses, but at the end of the day, we just got outplayed. You know, it, it's hard to shoot 48% from the field, 50% from the three, and lose by 30. Right. <laughs> found a way to do it. Rebounds you know? more than anything else? Yeah, it's, uh, it's rebounds. You know, we're giving up layups. I swear, I thought they hit at least 25 threes. That's what it felt like. But um, you got to give credit to them. They played well. Hey, what happened at the end of the game with you and Jody with those free throws? Um, honestly, I was so tired. I wasn't even paying attention. And uh, Jody doesn't mind taking points. So, uh, you know, I, I didn't really care that he went to the free throw line. Um, you played 40-plus minutes tonight. You may get asked to do that for a while. We don't know when these new guys are getting here. Uh, what's the key to that, to conditioning yourself to, to play 40 NBA minutes, maybe for a stretch of three or four games? Uh, part of it, you got to be a professional and realize that this is your job. The other part of it, uh, you got to take care of your body. Uh, you got to get your rest. And, um, you know, I feel like we're going to do a great job at, by committee. You know, it doesn't just fall on me because we're missing guys, but uh, doing it as a team. How much will it help when you, you guys are obviously undermanned. How much will it help when you get some people back? Uh, it'll help a lot. You know, our minutes will go down and uh, we'll, we'll be able to go harder in a lot shorter spurts. So um, anytime you can do that, it's better.